I'm really excited to get this to you. So Laura, this is the exact same watch that Elise had at that age, but we picked out just a little bit of a different color. They have a soft mint color now that we thought was so pretty. I can't have them for my like pictures. And boom! Oh my gosh! So, so me and Peyton made these. So you know our last night we had together? Mm hmm We decided to make these for you. Seriously? Mm -hmm. And we both decided these would be so cute on you. This was like my first day when I had this. I do your stuff on that one. Yeah. This one's pretty special. Yeah, I think it should be this one because it's the first picture I ever took. Yes. That's your first picture? Yeah, I took it with Lacey because she gave it to me. It turned out so good. No problem. I love you. Bye. Ew, that is so cute. Ooh, that is so cute. And my own towel. Ooh. Yeah, it's a new kind of towel. We're trying to call it Turkish towel. It's supposed to be really soft, but also compact. Not much. My shoe. <laughs> Let me feel it. So they say you're supposed to wash it once or twice before you start using it. And then it's supposed to not really pick up the sand. It's supposed to dry quickly, but also just be kind of like a comfy blanket. I like it. Or a, a dress up thing. <laughs> this one's from mom and dad. She's been listening on her new Kindle, but she's been using my super old, gross headphones. That leave black stuff on Yeah, the so you have your own wireless so Bluetooth cool. headphones. It looks like a fish tackle box. Mm -hmm. This does look like a fish tackle box. It's the same concept, but you can put all your little trinkets and jewelry. You have so many special things in your life. I thought you would enjoy some special stuff. It's your own little storage spot. Yeah. What are you going to listen to first? Hey! very excited to do Harry Potter too. Caleb offered to get Laura's watch all set up, get the time on there, teach her how to use it. Thank you, Caleb. He said he needs an emergency hug. That's like me and Papa's little thing. He's like, I need an emergency hug. Yep, she's opening up cards from the grandparents. So I noticed this morning you were a little bit sad at times. Yeah, because my birthday is at the end of the... Next month? Uh-huh. It's just hard to sing everyone's birthday goodbye, but not mine. It's hard to wait, huh? Mm -hmm. What do you think we could do today to make it still a special day for Laura? Be happier. Hey, I think you're handling it all really well. It makes yeah. sense that you're feeling a little bit impatient and wishing it was your birthday. That's a normal feeling. Yeah. All right, I'm loving this new swimsuit. Super cute. Thank you. I have to taste test it to make sure it's not poisonous. <laughs> The early taste test of eating all the strawberries. <laughs> Isaac made a smoothie for Laura. We have all sorts of fun going on in the kitchen this morning. The kids are helping get breakfast finished, but also, oh, I cannot get this open. Is it like really this is stuck? A tough one. <laughs> it's really stuck. Okay, well, I feel a little less weak now. So I just like did the pop thing and it just like twisted off with no effort. So it must have been a pressure issue. Thank you. Yeah. Jeez. Have the smoothie turn out. Isaac has been loving making smoothies.
And for Caleb, we made some cinnamon rolls. Holy donuts! Oh my goodness, you got three donuts. Happy birthday to you! Okay, we got a wish. Hmm. Laura's normally the wish police, so she oh, wants to. What do you want to do today as a family? Snorkel. Snorkel! It's really fun because we've been studying marine biology, and just this week we studied coral and coral reefs, and oh my goodness, it blew my mind. I'm so excited to get out there and see the coral. Did you know coral's an animal? I had no idea. a mirror with it. Mm -hmm. Look, I changed the picture. Is that from today? Mm -hmm. I'm excited to see all the new pictures that you started taking. For lunch, Laura requested Hawaiian haystacks, which is rice and like a chicken sauce, and then all sorts of different toppings. I love birthday season. There are just so many good meals. One that I love about you, Laura, is one, you pick amazing meals, and also you're really thoughtful to others. I love how good you are at singing and acting and how creative you are. You're just such an amazing sister. I just love hanging out with you. Like, you're just such a fun person. Like, I love, you like my extra head. Like, I can practice nails, hair, and all the things. And we can just hang out. Thank you. You are so creative and how you're good at singing and how you like being fun. Laura has an amazing smile and the ability to make everyone around her feel loved. She is so giving and kind and thoughtful and I feel like when she walks into the room, the room just lights up. She can tell when somebody's having a hard time and like wants to support them and she also has a great sense of humor. She's in for the fun no matter what we're doing. She wants to get involved and get right in the middle of it. I always tell her that she's a very important glue in our family. I love you. Thank you. My smile's gonna burst and it'll go like the Grinch. Like the Grinch? <laughs> <laughs> All right, Daddy. One of the things I love about Laura is how adventurous she is. She's really loved coming out snorkeling with me a lot. And that's like one of our things that we do together. And I love doing that with you. I'll always remember something we do together. She is brave and adventurous. All right, what do you love about Laura? Hmm, I think I like how I always want to try new things. Not foods. Not foods yet? Not foods yet. But things. You are always willing to try stuff. So Laura chose a little family adventure for her birthday. We're going to a new place. It's called Viking Arena. We've never been there before. Was 
definitely my favorite part of the ritual. The part where I tried to like, kind of like, try to be brave and like, I wasn't touching anything. And Ooh. Really scary. The scariest one was the one with like the, there was like this tube on the bottom and there were two springs and they were connected and then there was this clear plate. I almost fell multiple times. Well, it wasn't stable. It wasn't. It was like wobbly and it wasn't connected. The coolest one was definitely the like the skateboard because you had to pull it. They're cheering for you, man. So big. It was easy, hardish. Was it scary? No, not at all. I love the time when you tried to slap mom's hand. Yeah. Did you get it? Got her middle finger. Oh, you just barely nicked her? Um, I got a high five mom, which I really love. The coolest part was walking on the little thing. Climbing that up, up to the top. Uh -huh. At the end, right when we were about to leave, I jumped down from the top and landed on the middle. You excited to try it? Yeah. You are so brave. <laughs> Up. And then what I did was I pushed it down and I jumped and I flipped, which was so much fun. And I did that multiple times. <laughs> <laughs> so they would put soap on the bottom so it was really slippery. We would like flip every time that we went down. The ball pit is, was super fun. Me and Laura decided that we were going to take all of the balls and throw them into one pit. These random strangers came and Isaac was like, everyone hide. So then they would like jump on us or something. So we came up with Janae and I, I thought you guys were gone. They were like hidden, like dead people. I really was like, dang, where did they go? And I looked around, I was like, maybe they're in the ball pit. And Janae runs in and jumps right on the ball pit. Yeah, I loved just hitting dad. So me and Isaac would hit dad and I got dad pretty hard. <laughs> <laughs> I remember we did a race with all of us sliding down the slides. There were four of us all together. Oh, yeah. Tell me about it. I won. I think I won. No, I was in front the whole time because I went first. But I then, like, right at the end, I I zoomed past you. No. Oh, yeah. I, I won. I won. We'll have to do an instant replay. <laughs> So when there was a challenge for me <laughs> to do the obstacle course, did you think you were gonna win? I was the one filming and I was racing alongside them and it was super funny to watch. The funny part was they kept pulling each other down. <laughs> <laughs> try to grab me, but I also knew I was going to win. <laughs> Yay, go on, <laughs> yes. <You won>. <laughs> <laughs> and that was the end. But it was fun. That was really, really fun. <laughs> Woo! You got me. Got it's time for Laura's date with Jeremy and I, and she has been saying for months that she wanted to come to the Cheesecake Factory. She loves cheesecake, and she's never been here before, so we're excited to eat with her and take some cheesecake home for her birthday cake. Well, look how much stuff is in here. Laura, you should see the entire cheesecake yep. menu. It's like a book. The Cheesecake Factory has the most options ever. If you want a special menu. Ooh, a special menu. Those are uh, alcoholic beverages. No, there's also, <laughs> yeah. um, so Laura put on some lip gloss. She's wearing her dangly earrings. And she's got her birthday pin. And my watch. And your watch. You are ready to go. Do you have some perfume on too? No. Strawberry lemonade twins. How is it? Is it good? Laura chose orange chicken. And I chose some truffle honey chicken. Jeremy, what did you order? Yes. I got a hamburger. The bacon bacon burger. The coconut cream pie 
orange coconut cream pie and salted caramel, so both of those. So many good options. We have original cheesecake with strawberries, Oreo cheesecake, vanilla bean cheesecake, confetti birthday cake cheesecake, coconut cream pie cheesecake, and salted caramel cheesecake. I love these flavors. Like, each time they're saying, like, <laughs> Happy birthday, dear Laura. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. Cha, cha, cha. Cha, cha. Yeah. I am going to be so interested. What flavor is everyone's favorite? It's going to be the coconut. I know. That's what I was thinking, too. It's going to be the coconut. Vanilla what? bean is good, too. I know. That's what I was Maybe the original. I've never tried the original. I'm going to try it today. I'm excited for the Oreo one. I've tried this one, this one, and this one. I'm so full. And so Janae wants a big piece. All right, Lori. Strawberry. 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 She's going for the salted pie. Which other one? She looks at it, thinks about it. <laughs> she giggles. She's going in for the bite. Uh oh. And take oh. away fakey. She hesitates. Second. Oh, oh, oh. fakey again. <laughs> and will she score? Oh. But what does she think of the flavor? Good. Should we got a thumbs up? But it's just mm -hmm. good. Not amazing. Not incredible. Just. Mom, can I try it a little? You think it's amazing? Right? Mhm. Mm she loves it. When did you find your love for cheesecake, Laura? When you and Marla made cheesecake. Oh yeah. And then oh. mom kept on going to the Cheesecake Factory after that visit, because <laughs> they were having dates a lot, and I was like, cheesecake, cheesecake, cheesecake. We're ending off a very fun, very long day with a family movie at the end of Good night, Jay House out. The house flooded. There's water just shooting out. So Jeremy and I recently celebrated our 18th anniversary.